hi guys welcome to my channel hope you're doing well so capricorn this will be for you if you have any capricorn placements if you're dealing with the capricorn please hit the messages that resonate and leave the rest okay guys as this is a general reading if you'd like a personal reading all the information is in the description box below please subscribe like share comment if it resonates with you okay guys thank you to everybody who has already subscribed i do appreciate you okay so capricorn let's see what's going on for you guys let's see what is happening for you capricorn what messages does spirit have for you what would you like capricorn to know what would you like capricorn to know right now we have it's time to take action new moon in aries okay time to take action capricorn don't let don't let your past hold you back south node now i, I spoke about this like twice today capricorn um <clears throat> with uh actually a few signs because of what's come out today so i feel like a lot of people are coming to the end of a cycle or a period of of things that's no longer the serving them so i feel like a lot of things they're going to be changing okay and the energy is shifting big time which is great this is what we like to see okay what else do we have for capricorn what else would you like capricorn to know spirit so we have capricorn we have balance spirituality and practicality full moon in pisces okay and we have a time for healing balsamic Bal Bas moon i don't even know if i'm saying that right so anyways but a time for healing okay so yeah so something from your past has, has held you back but you know i feel like once you actually there's some of you guys have been healing um internally externally okay could, could be both could be either either or but it's time to, it's time i feel like what i'm getting is like you know this reminds me of like it kind of reminds me of um my journey when i was healing and i was praying for all the things i wanted but then i was like okay now it's time to actually do those things that i've been praying for okay there's only so much that spirit your angels god can do for you the rest is up to you is what i'm getting okay so let's see what other messages spirit has for you today capricorn what other messages do you have for capricorn today so we'll be doing tarot after this okay guys what other messages do you have okay we have high priest intend and create Mm -hmm. and see her see beyond the current situation do you know what literally i've done what six signs so far six different signs today and these cards are just matching up with with what's coming up what i'm saying so intend and create like what's your intentions what is it that you need to create to move forward okay and it's not so much how things are looking now but it's almost like manifest like see yourself doing something see yourself doing something whatever it is that you're desiring right now okay capricorn and this could this can really resonate with different areas of your life it could be a career your journey spiritually okay your love life many other things as well we have white witch be the light some of you guys have Pisces in your chart as well, Capricorn. Um, some of you guys are light workers. And we have warrior, be fearless and stand strong, okay? Okay, so there could be something spiritually that you're meant to do, okay, guys? It could literally be tarot. It could be some. It doesn't have to be spiritually, but like some of you guys you are healers some of you guys are looking at um caring for others helping people heal whether it's um spiritually physically mentally emotionally whatever way so let's see what comes up for you for the, in the tarot so what messages do you have for capricorn <clears throat> what messages do you have for capricorn
okay that turned around so i'll take that so we have knight of pentacles two of swords we have the hanged man and the temperance it's been a long journey but there's still kind of there's some kind of indecisive energy here and with the hanged man it's kind of like really trying to figure out really trying to like look at things from a different perspective okay it's for you to move forward that's this is what it is this is this is you moving forward after a long period this is you i feel like is you kind of getting rid of certain like old ways of thinking and embracing a new something new you are healing you are healing so we have pisces there we have sagittarius uh, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, and Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Okay, what else would you like Capricorn to know? What else would you like Capricorn to know? Thank you. So we have the Moon, got Cancer energy there. We've got the Sun, Leo energy. And we've got the World in Reverse. Some of you guys are happy that something has been delayed. Uh, I feel like it's giving you an opportunity to address your emotions. Um, something's going to make you really happy here some kind something that you're healing from is something emotionally it's something emotionally okay and i feel like once you've some of you guys have gone through this already once you've addressed that once you, it's like oh, peace like i feel at ease i feel calm but there's some kind of delay and i feel like it's the, the delays being there um only to allow you to heal first before you move forward, which is very important. I feel like you'll be at your best. You'll be your best self. Okay. What what is in the future for Capricorn? The magician. The magician. Ten of Swords. Four of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. So I see that. I see you walking away from something that once betrayed you. I see you. <clears throat> saying i have to let that go i'm manifesting something new i'm letting go of what does what no longer serves me king of wands and i'm and i'm going after my dreams i'm going after what i'm passionate about you're gonna be very happy like literally that's come out twice now the moon the sun and the eight of cups to the king of wands you're moving towards something that's gonna make you happy five of pentacles uh five five of swords i beg your pardon this is something that you're gonna fight for i feel like once you've healed and you've and you've you, and you're like do you know what this place of peace this place of calm nothing can let's just be real nothing can fuck with that yeah you're not allowing anything to mess with that and that's why you you refuse to let anything from the past hold you back you are fighting now nine of swords What I'm getting as well is like I feel like there's there's certain people that you're att attached to that kind of um, benefited you being the old version of yourself and they may cause some kind of conflict and stress. But you know what, guys, I feel like that's why I'll say you, you're not allowing this. So you kind of know that there's somebody around you that will kind of stress you out and, and, and say ridiculous things. For some of you guys, it's, a, it's being around this particular person. I don't know if it's a family member, a part, partner, ex-partner. Um, but the page of pentacles in reverse as well there. Some of you guys are blocking out this person. You will block out this person. You're going to actually... I'm getting unfriend. So you, uh, you could be unfriending some people on social media or stuff like that. Or like in real life. Like you're not going to be um, entertaining certain things. Certain things. Shadow side. Yeah, shadow side. Seven of pentacles, king of cups. You're, you're maturing um, uh, emotionally, guys. Yeah, this is what's getting you um, moving forward. For some of you, it's something to do with the father of your kids or you are the father and you're getting to that place where you're, you're actually good. You're healed within yourself and you're, be, you're able to be a better, not only person, but just like um, if you're a male um, father, son, brother, you know, colleague or whatever, like it is it's allowing you to these changes internally please tell me more thank you ace of swords in reverse you feel you feel like you've been lied to quite a lot someone's held the truth from you that's why you've walked away from them and that's allowed you to heal you're walking away queen of cups oh you feel like oh 
so there's somebody here it could be another it could be a water sign or an air sign okay pisces cancer pisces cancer scorpio aquarius gemini libra but what i'm getting is like some of you guys are there's there's some lies between you and this person there's some truths that were left unsaid and that's why someone doesn't feel like this can move forward for some of you guys this is about love for some of you guys it's just internal conflict that you just can't deal with anymore okay one last card for capricorn thank you so we have the four of wands four of wands so somebody that you could have been married to or had a long um commitment with somebody that you live with okay some of you guys might be moving home yeah some of you guys might be moving home as well I feel like once this energy has changed, once you've addressed this, some of you guys have, and you and everyone's on different timelines, but once this internal conflict is dealt with, it's like so people will be upset because they're, they're wondering why they can't get the better of you or have you around them. It's because they're not, they're not helping you in any way, mentally, spiritually, emotionally. But I do see some of you guys, you might actually fall in love with a Leo or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So some of you guys, it is that. Some of you guys are going to fall in love, okay? You may long-term get married to this person. So take what resonates, leave the rest, guys, because it's going to be different for everybody. I want to leave it there. Please actually subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next reading. Bye, guys.